Hey guys, what's up? Rajat here from VFX World. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. Guys, today I'll show you one of the most exciting facial makeup process inside of Nuke. It's called Frequency Separation Technique. So by using that technique, you can do lots of things inside of Nuke by frame by frame or in a JPEG as well. So before starting this tutorial, I want to clarify something that if you guys are looking for a job, job notifications, then do follow or like our Facebook page. Link is in description. Okay then, let's get started. So this is a very short tutorial and trust me guys this will be very much interesting. So before starting this tutorial I want to tell you something that for this tutorial you have to install uh, something which is uh, really important without that you can't do this kind of thing. So uh, this thing I downloaded from this side you can go and download it from there otherwise link is in description just go and download. So when you download this you can find these four files then what you have to do you have to just copy these four files just control c or right click copy uh, whenever you download you can find it inside of a zip file okay then go to this pc and windows c over there you can find your user and then your name that like my name is rajat b and over there you can find dot nuke folder just go and simply paste it over there then open your nuke so when you open your nuke then press tab on your keyboard and press free so it will come a ch underscore frequency separation okay so this is our tool which will come when you install that or just copy and paste so just select this you can find a cool node over there when is like mask and one is image so just connect it like this so automatically the image pipe will connect to this mask uh, sorry the uh, node and the mask one is left so now what is basic concern is to make this mask uh, sorry to make this uh, like this marks uh, really cool and this should be good okay this is a main concern so now what you have to do first uh, let's uh, select let's see this is a project settings is 1350 so press s on your keyboard go down and from there you have to choose like 1350 by 900 just make it one okay so now everything is set let's start uh, to make this character uh, very pretty so press O on your keyboard to take a rotor node and then connect this mask to this rotor node and then simply I'm doing a rough mask just like this and make sure guys you have to uh, understand what is a scripting this is a Python scripting process uh, the script is downloaded but you can make your own in your if you know python scripting uh, so now this is done and just make it a little more precise and yep the shapes are uneven actually i am doing it roughly don't quote me on that that like i am doing this way that you are you guys are doing the same way why this is not happening because see whenever you are doing anything it based on your own way i am doing it another way you are doing another way but yes the technique should be same make sure that so select all this press z Two, three times now it become a very smooth and then control and just drag it a little bit so it's become a feather press a on your keyboard you can see everything so the basically a is for alpha but this time we are not marked out anything so that's why we can't see alpha but I am pressing a for uh, showing you guys that what happened when you drag this so this is what happened now what I have to do press a again now just release this one and yeah just double click see the rotor node is came again and then select this frequency separation node and you start working so first of all you have to blur this so when you increase this blur you can see this area is little going blurred can you see this yes so it's blurred so now the magical part will done when you increase the details so when you increase the details you can see uh, something happened right so you have to adjust this increase the blur a little more slightly and the details should go a little up and down and it's almost we're almost very close just increase little yeah this is fine this is almost fine so this this like this uh, you can see this mask and all you have to remove by manually by using rotopaint known cloning and all but this area is really fine now you can do it in your own way you can take so much time to adjust this but I'm showing you the basic way 
just decrease little little more decrease no it's too much blurred increase the little more yeah this is fine okay so now you have to make sure you have to remove this one so you have you can take the same roto node double click and take a bezier and just when you take your bezier node you can just start working okay so i'm just uh, selecting from here see a bezier b spline let's take b spline uh, I really love B-spline because every time when we are doing work in our industry, B-spline is the most uh, expensive tool we called. So just see, it's automatically start working. So the nose one left. So just connect it. So basic idea is why we are taking B-spline because the B-spline is always by default smooth. So that's why we ha don't have to make it smooth. See, it's already it's just curve is smoothly curved. Okay. So that's why you are taking B spline, but when you are taking Bezier, we have to make a smoother, which I did before a few times back. You can see that we press Z on our keyboard and we did that. Now this is done and you can do lot more shapes in a different, different way and different, different frequency separation node to make it more precise. But uh, in this tutorial, I have shown only this much because I think you already understand what I'm trying to show you in this by using this uh, tutorial okay guys so when it will complete exactly after all roto paint node this remove all the masks you, it will completely look like this hopefully guys you really love this tutorial this is a very short simple tutorial from nuke based on frequency separation process and if you like this then before leaving this tutorial please do subscribe like comment and share i will see you in my next tutorial till then have fun stay healthy bye bye